Now on BBC World News, the biggest African and international news stories. Focus on Africa. Hello, I'm Sophie Ikenye. Welcome to Focus on Africa, our top stories. Back to school, children in Uganda finally returned to class after nearly two years away because of COVID. We have missed out a lot and the COVID-19 era has like really disturbed our education, but I'm really excited to come back. Aid agencies suspend operations in parts of the Tigray region in Ethiopia after an airstrike on a camp for displaced people kills dozens. Also in the program, it's been a long time coming, but AFCON is on. And I'm Peter Kwache, live from Yaoundé, the capital of Cameroon, from where we'll bring you all the thrills from the ongoing Africa Cup of Nations. Thanks for joining us on Focus on Africa from BBC World News. Uganda has ended one of the world's longest school closures. Millions of children are to return to the classroom after nearly two years away because of COVID. Although classes were available online and on radio when schools were shut, almost 50% of children had no access to internet or required equipment. Now, the reopening of schools has been welcomed by many. Patience Atuhaire has been following developments.